the uh, fine work that Arsenal have done building that bridging that gap between the players and of course the fans wherever they are in the world that something like this can still resonate the other side of our can't resist either you love to see it don't you and there is another very popular figure Joe Montemurro of course a title winner with the go that weight and deliver so the man who brought Steph Catley to North London before the likes of uh, Cooney Cross followed. Here we go then, Arsenal to get us underway. Pullover switching play for Caitlin Ford, a first chance for her to get her opposite number, Alana Cern. It's round her two. It's cruising in the area. Oh, that's more than enough players back there defending there, the All-Stars, although that clearance very nearly found its way past Lydia Williams. Yeah, look, the full-back stands off Caitlin Ford way too much there. She's able to feed the ball into the box and in the end get themselves an easy corner. Just listen to the roar that Kyra Cooney Cross receives before she swings this one in. Reed was climbing. He's a young player. You want to be fearless. Here comes Ford again. And to pull one back for Russo and Morrison is well placed to clear. Yeah, look, look, exceptionally dangerous down that left hand side. You probably shouldn't be surprised, you know, you've got Ford keeps the attack alive. It's a lovely uh, shift of direction from her. Not the worst ball in. Russo was gambling there. Maybe Williams stayed on her line, it was the right decision. Yeah, it was a real high degree of difficulty here for Katrine Cool. Lovely play from Caitlin Ford. This has got to be perfect. She's just looking at Keller Knight drives it in easily away by Ford. Out only as far as the edge of the box and then lashed well over the bar by Tamika Yala. Yeah, look, it'll go down as a shot, but <laughs> never really threatened, did it? You know, it's not the best clearance there from Caitlin Ford, but it's a really ambitious effort. Taking her a bit further wide than she would have wanted. She does have Cooney Cross there for support. Ford screaming for it at the far post. Cool, waiting for Vivian Lear on the overlap. Oh, that's a great ball in for Russo! Arsenal do take the lead. They've been struggling to find that quality. And when it came, it came from the boots of a 17-year-old Academy product. Vivian Leo with the assist, Russo with the pinpoint header, and Arsenal with the lead. Brilliant football from Arsenal. What a cross from Viv Leo. They give her time and space. They stand off her. And she just puts it right onto the head of Alessia Russo, who pulls off the shoulder of her marker. And she never looks like missing. It's a textbook header from the Arsenal centre forward. And it's a goal that the Gunners deserve. Well, she scored 16 times last season, Alessia Russo. She started uh, the season so well. Tamiki Allop into play, and here's Courtney Vine. A clear outlet on their right-hand side. Good ball in from her as well, and Katie Reid read the danger. Reid at the first attempt, the attack still alive for the A-League All-Stars until a fairly tame attempt from Tamiki Yala. Did well. If uh, Steph Catley as well. <laughs> you don't see this too often, do you? Just before half time, a change of goalkeeper journey within the uh, women's national team setup. Jada Wyman. Still just 24 years old, plays for Sydney FC. The championship winning goalkeeper last season. And that will be it then for the first 45 minutes of this uh, All Stars match. And it was Alessia Russo who was able to break the deadlock following a fantastic ball in by 17 year old Vivienne Leah.
The Gunners have dominated possession. The A-League uh, All-Stars women have still looked dangerous on the break. Courtney Brule of these Gunners in attendance. Off we go. Lead again, reading the uh, flight of the ball. Nice turn from Frieda Marnham, who looked to play his wits against the Arsenal. The Cass, space to turn. Fox on the supporting run. The Cass went by herself. Routine stop in the end for Wyman. Well, she can hit them, can't she? Chloe Lacas, we've seen that in her debut season here. Got a lovely bit of space to run in. Just area, here's Kim Little. Ford wanting it to her left, she gets it. Here is Caitlin Ford, straight at Jada Wyman in the end. Matos had uh, cut off the angle. Yeah, the defender was blocking the far post, so I think it's smart. Why not? Why not just go and follow it? I'm a big fan of the Arsenal number 29s as well, my old number. Here's Caitlin Ford skipping inside. Took a deflection on its way through. I think it was Rebecca Stott again who got a vital intervention. Will be an Arsenal corner. Uh, she's been a handful all night, hasn't she, Caitlin Ford? So many times she's faced up 1v1. She's mixed it, mixed up the way she's gone here. She just ducks inside. It's really, really good defending, isn't it? On the inside. Oh, Goldie showing a bit too much of that to Michelle Heyman. Can the All Stars counter? Heyman has stayed out to the left hand side. He's looking for the return pass. It's Policina. Naomi Williams saw it all the way. Well held by the Arsenal teenager. Yeah, it was an awkward one, wasn't it? For the Arsenal youngster, just skidded off the turf. Yeah, they they turned that transition into... Offensive midfielder. Lacasse in behind, and Stott had to get that one right. <laughs> there was a brief look of panic from the... All-Stars captain, before she saw that one go the other side of the post. I don't know, she doesn't look very flustered. Cool. Ducking away from one to find Ford. Goes for goal, and it was uh, safe for the cameras there. In Melbourne. One over the top, it's a lovely ball by Kim Little. Freedom on him. Space opens up, it's cool. Straight into the gloves. Jada Wyman. Pity. It's nicely worked, isn't it? Here's Ford. Matos retreats. Ford twists and turns. And the pass. Given away, though, by Williams. Abini will try a luck and Wilkinson to try to hold up. They've done well here. And she's through. Hannah Wilkinson on goal, and there is the big save at a big moment. Naomi Williams gets her chance to shine. Superb save from Naomi Williams. It's the best chance they've had by a mile. The All-Stars, she's threatening long, a distribution excellent, defending spotless, um, and yeah, just one of, of several really, really good performances from the from the kids. Well, the Gunners have travelled down under and they will head back to North London. Feeling like this was an incredibly successful trip. A blend of youth, of experience, valuable minutes in the legs of some incredibly promising youngsters and a chance, of course, for old friends to be reunited in familiar settings. It's uh, Alessia Russo's goal from Vivian Lea's fantastic cross which separates the two sides and gives the only side of our some uh, bragging.